The Rock County District Attorney determined the police sergeant who shot and killed a 19 year old man earlier this year acted lawfully. You are looking at the moments leading up to that shooting in March. Roscoe, Illinois Police Sergeant Robert Lewis shot Ray Castro after Castro rammed the officer's squad car. Tonight we are breaking down the new footage that was just released. Grace Old has you covered on what the video shows in the moments leading up to and during the shooting because police had their body and squad cameras turned on. We do want to warn you the video is hard hard to watch and we will be showing the first shots the sergeant fired. It all started with a traffic stop in Illinois just after 9 o'clock on a Saturday morning in March. 19 year old Ray Castro was in the passenger seat when officers confirmed he had outstanding felony warrants and tried to take him into custody. Castro struggled with police before running away. He ended up at Mactown Lounge in South Beloit, where police say he held a maintenance man at gunpoint, carjacking him, putting Castro in this maroon SUV. The district attorney's records say Castro drove at high speeds into Beloit through numerous stop signs and red lights, nearly crashing into multiple vehicles. At the intersection of Central Avenue and Strong Avenue in Beloit, an officer hit Castro's stolen SUV on the back driver's side. Before Castro could accelerate again, Sergeant Lewis of the Roscoe, Illinois Police Department got out of his squad car and started shooting. Before we start playing this video, another warning that you will see and hear three gunshots fired as Sergeant Lewis shoots at Castro while Castro is driving a car straight towards Lewis. We're stopping the video there because the rest is too graphic for television, but we can't explain what the video shows. Castro's car is pinned right at the driver's door of Lewis's squad car, and you hear Lewis fire 12 more shots, take a beat, then fire three more into Castro's windshield. Castro died shortly after. The Rock County District Attorney concluded that Sergeant Lewis was acting in self-defense. The district attorney's report says Ray Castro was shot as a direct result of his own actions. For 27 News, Grace Alch.